Assalamu alaikum boys and girls. I have another story for you, which is my Allah series from Kisa Kids. I will be reading uh, the story called Be Thankful to Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala. So let's begin. A'udhu billahi minash shaitan irajim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. There are many ways to thank the people who help us every day. We thank our parents by giving them kisses and listening to what they say. What are some things that you thank, thank your parents for? So boys and girls, what are some things that you are thankful for your parents? We thank our teachers by giving them gifts and we love to watch as their smiles begin to lift. What do you thank your teachers for? Your, all your special teachers and your regular teachers and your homeroom teachers. What are you thankful for? Do you like that you're learning from them? We thank our friends by sharing our toys or how that fills our hearts with joy. Which toys do you share with your friends? Boys and girls, are you thankful for the toys that you have and that you are able to share it with other people? How can we thank Allah when he has given us so much? He has given us our family, our friends, and food that we eat for dinner and lunch. What do you see in the picture that the family should thank for? They have, looks like they have food in front of them. Looks like they have, a brother has a sister and the sister has a brother. And both the children have their parents to be thankful for. And looks like they have a nice house that they have to be thankful for. Or boys and girls, look around your house and the people inside your house. And tell me what are you thankful for. And we should also be thankful for our religion that we are Muslims. Allah gave us hands, legs and eyes. So we can play on the swings. We should thank Allah when we use any of these things. How do you see your hands, legs, and eyes when you eat at the park? When you are at the park, you know, you are able to use your hands. You have two beautiful hands to hold tight. You have two beautiful legs so that you can walk up to the park. There are so many things to be thankful for. Allah has given us delicious food, including fruits and yummy veggies. How can we thank Allah when we eat all these goodies? What is your favorite food that you are thankful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for? Looks like the boys and girls, they love apples and they are going and picking up apples from the apple tree. So boys and girls, what is your favorite food that you are thankful for? We can thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala by using gentle words and doing good deeds. I am thankful Allah by kindly helping my, I am thanking Allah by kindly helping my sister with what she needs. What good things have you done? She, he is helping the little sister. It looks like he's taking care of the little sister while the mother mommy is cooking food isn't that great so mommy is also thankful for the little boy for taking care of his little sister and the mommy is able to cook yummy yummy food because the children are busy taking care and playing with each other when we help our mother water the plants we are thanking allah for a wonderful hands how do you use your hands to help your mother? So we are saying to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, thank you Allah for help giving me hands so I can do things for others and for myself. What, do you, what are the things do you do to help your mommy and your daddy? When we misses, visit the masjid and pray with each other, we thank Allah for our sisters and brothers. What are some things you do when you go to the masjid? Aren't we thankful that we meet our friends? We meet our friends from school. We meet our 
friends from our community and we have a good time when we meet each other in the masjid. So what do you look forward for when you go for masjid? What do you look forward for? When we visit the sick, we are thanking Allah for our healthy body. So let's thank Allah by doing good deeds every day. Let's practice, practice saying, Thank you Allah, Shukran Allah, Alhamdulillah. So boys and girls, in everything we do, we need to be thankful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And if anyone asks you, how are you? Instead of saying, I'm fine, you can use the words like, Alhamdulillah, because you are fine by the praise of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So instead of using words like, I'm good or I'm fine, say alhamdulillah and uh, these are some good kisa books i hope you enjoyed this book and inshallah i will come back again with more books until we meet again